Let's send it down to Matt Weiner. Take it away, Matt. All right, Brian. I'm here with Austin Jackson, who got that wild five-run second inning started with a steal of third base. After the way things went in game one, how good did it feel to kind of get the action going on your end? Uh, it definitely felt good. I think anytime you can, uh, you know, put uh, pressure on the opposing team, um, you, you know, you're doing your job. Um, you know, we, we didn't you know, do our, our job offensively and get those those runs yesterday, but we did a good job of bouncing back, uh, keeping our focus, and, and uh, you know, Hendricks did a good job for us. He he was able to, uh, you know, each and every inning give us a chance, and, and uh, we took advantage of it. Ever been part of an inning with two safety squeezes? Uh, no, I don't think so, but, uh, you know, it worked out in our favor. Uh, you know, we've been working on that a little bit, and, uh, uh, you know, we did a good, a good job of uh, executing that tonight. How much differently does this series feel now, 1-1, with you guys going back to Chicago and your horse on the mound? Uh, you know, it feels, it feels good, you know, you, you having that momentum going into – uh, Chicago, uh, you know, I think it's only going to motivate the, motivate us that, that much more to really go out there and uh, try to get those wins. You came really late in the season, an August 31st deal. What have you learned about this club? Uh, they keep fighting, man. It's a, it's a, it's a bunch of uh, young, hungry guys with, with a mix of uh, some veterans, and uh, sometimes that's that mix that you need to. Uh, you need that fire from the young, younger guys, and the veterans are there to kind of kind of school them through it a little bit. Congrats. We'll see you at Wrigley. All right. Thank you. Appreciate it. Brian? All right. Thanks a lot, Matt.